हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम बैक टू जीके टुडे आम पला खंडेलवा टुडे वी आर डिस्कसिंग दी टॉप एमसीक्यू व्हिच आर रिलेटेड टू दी बैंकिंग इकोनॉमी एंड फाइनेंस करंट अफेयर्स ऑफ 15th ऑफ जून 2022 सो दी सीरीज इज बेनिफिशियल फॉर ऑल बैंकिंग एग्जाम एस्पिरेंट्स सो व्हिच स्टेट हैज निर्मला सीतारमण द यूनियन फाइनेंस मिनिस्टर इनॉग्रेटेड धरोहर द नेशनल म्यूजियम ऑफ कस्टम एंड जीएसटी so the correct answer of this question is option c that is in goa so the union finance minister nirmala sitaraman dedicated to the national darohar the national museum of custom and gst in goa so basically the darohar is house in panji famous blue building on the bank of mandovi river okay so now move to the next question which company has acquired a stake in flipkart what USD 264 million from its co-founder Biani Bansal. So the correct answer of this question is option B, that is Tencent. So recently, the Chinese technology firm Tencent has bought stake worth USD 264 million in Flipkart from its co-founder Biani Bansal through its European subsidiary. Okay, so now move to the next question. Individual housing loan limit for urban cooperative bank and rural cooperative banks have been increased by the Reserve Bank of India. So, for rural cooperative bank with assets net worth less than hundred crore, the limit has been increased to how much? So, the correct answer of this question is option D, that is rupees hundred lakh. So, the limit has been increased from twenty lakh to fifty lakh from RCB with assets net worth. Less than hundred crore. Okay, so now move to the next question. Which payment institution has partnered with Go Digital General Insurance Limited to offer shop insurance to small and medium sized business? So the correct answer of this question is option B. That is Finno Payment Bank. So the Finno Payment Bank Limited has partnered with Go Digital General Insurance Limited, one of the India's fastest growing general insurance, to provide small and medium business owner with a shop insurance coverage. Okay, so now move to the next question. Which electric two wheelers manufacturer has partnered up with the State Bank of India to provide customer with vehicle financing? So the correct answer of this question is option D. So recently, the Ather Energy and electric two-wheeler manufacturer based in Bangalore in Karnataka has partnered with the State Bank of India to offer vehicle financing for its customer. Okay, so now move to the next question. Who has been appointed as a new MD and CEO of RBL Bank? So the correct answer of this question is option C. So recently, the Reserve Bank of India has appointed RS Subram Mani Kumar as a MD and CEO of RBL Bank. So basically, he has been appointed at RBL for three years from the date of taking charge. Okay, so now move to the next question. Which of the following state government has released fruit software for Aadhaar based single window scheme registration? So the correct answer of this question is option D. That is Karnataka. So the Karnataka government has launched the farmer registration and unify beneficiary information system or fruit software for aadhar based single window registration for schemes okay so now move to the next question which of the following online gaming activities has recently been the subject of guidelines issued by ministry of information and broadcasting so the correct answer of this question is option a that is bat batting and gambling so recently the advisory comes in light of instance of number of ad advertisement of online batting website or platform appearing in print electronic social and online media so as per ministry batting and gambling are illegal in most of the part of the country and pose significant financial and social economic risk for consumer apart from that these advertisement for online batting have the effect of promoting this largely prohibited activity so presently the advertisement for online batting and misleading do not appear in the strict conformity with the consumer protection act 2019 and advisory code and the cable television network regulation act 1995 okay so now move to the next question according to an icra report the percentage of nbfc bad loan decreased to what percentage in march 2022 so the correct answer of this question is option b that is 4.4% 
So the non-banking financial company and housing finance company has shown improvement in their asset quality after the Omicron variant. So the main reason behind it was a stricter standard for income recognition, asset classification, and disposal that came in force in October. Apart from this, NBFC depreciation remained high and marginally high compared to last year. Housing finance company depreciation was modest. So according to credit rating agency, the bad loan for NBFC decreased significantly during the quarter compared to the housing finance loan. So basically, the bad loan from NBFC decreased to 4.4 percent in March 2022, from 5.7 percent in December 2021. Okay, so now move to the next question. Which of the following countries' gas has recently become India's second largest oil exporters? So the correct answer of this question is option D, that is Russia. So as per the recent report, Russia rose to become the India's second biggest supplier of oil in May, pushing Saudi Arabia into third place. Okay, 